हाय श्री गुड मॉर्निंग या गुड मॉर्निंग नंदा या थैंक यू ओके एंड टुडे वी विल बी कंडक्टिंग अ जॉब ओरिएंटेड वर्कशॉप ओके so here we will be discussing like you know some of the folks are not being to be hold their job for a longer time and even though that is the reason being that we have been come up with some ideas like where we can be delivered some of the good things like you know where they can stand their job for a longer time so that's the reason being that we are been conducting an you know, tosca job support oriented workshop for an you know, 2k21 so this is being conducted by completely within a next it career so this will be travel for a 10 days okay so if anybody if anyone has been interested if anyone is more interested on this so please contact on a below contact number as well as you can drop an email to the given email id okay okay so, so that makes sense and uh, so let's look, look into the what are the agenda we have been brought up into the particular program and how we will be going to travel for a entire entire uh, our workshop for a 10 days and what are the things we will be going to deliver it okay so next next look into the next slide so so here thing is that the major people are being lagging more the time into the communication like uh, once they get into the job and once they get into an uh, it sector so they will be having a knowledge but they are not able to demonstrate to the their managers like for example they will not be having a much communication they will be very much scared about how to uh, demonstrate whatever the things they have done by themselves so that is the reason being that we will be conducting a, some soft skill uh, drive in this because this will be help for the lot of folks and what are the things we can deliver and what the things to be elaborate to the what the things to be elaborate to the the team lead and managers okay so apart okay. from that yeah please yeah i said okay okay fine and uh, after that sometime what will happen you are good enough in the technologies you are good enough in the things but you are been a good team player in the entire your team but still you are lagging with the things how do we go ahead and explain and how do we define yourself if something goes wrong and sometime what will happen the team leads will be going to define in such a way if you are not engaged more the time with the team if you are not coordinating with the teams and if you are not coordinating with a team lead and a managers at the moment they will be think like the team the whatever the guy is working he is not performing good so either he may be a fake but he may not be a background of technology what they have been provided you so then they will start doubting you at the moment how do you stand your job how the things will be going to happen in a it sector how can we talk to them how do you demonstrate so in such areas we will be going to explain and even though in the span of in the journey of this drive we will be explain you how do we tackle these kind of things in a real time scenarios and apart from that on each and every work assignment like in the sense each and every day we will be providing a some assessment and a task creation in the sense we will be providing a some task that task will be done here itself then that task will be going to review because the before getting the job you should be a well equipped in a tosca if you are well equipped then you could able to tackle any of the task which is being assigned by in your project okay so that is the reason each and every resource should be a well equipped then we will be discussing here only the real time oriented scenarios how the end to end flows will be work how we will be uh, debug the thing and what are the things we will be tackling and how the things will be in a real time okay those things will be going to take in a assessment task and as well as a task creation okay and apart from that uh, there will be a work flows will be a different in a different different companies and whenever you get into a new company how do you follow the work flows and which one is the best approach when you get into a first time into the company because in some of the it sector 
they does have a different kind of submitting a time sheet and uh, whenever you get into the company first you have to be complete some of the prerequisite task like uh, some trainings you have to be complete so yes there is a lot of process will be there when you get into the company so you should not take these kind of things very lightly because these things only have their first impression if you lose your first impression and it will be impact very badly so that's the reason working flow understanding is a very very important topic okay so this is also will be conducted in our in our uh, workshop drive okay every day task will be given to the basis of a real time stuff okay we will be assuming and we will be taking what kind of real time scenarios will be coming those things will be explained and we will be giving a task for every day okay that will be reviewed by each other and even though we will be discussing how the things we will be conduct in a real time scenario end up okay so on the basis of that you guys has to be a very clear and you should be very active here because if you spend a very good time the span of 10 days that will be and a very good and uh, it will be a very good time for you for next two years or one year where you are spending in your it career okay that does it make sense for you mm -hmm. okay yes nanda uh, actually i have one question just yes, please can, can i ask yes yes yeah. please go so, ahead oh, the thing is the work assessments and task creation these are comes under like technical stuff or any uh, any other thing like actually this one is tosca job support oriented right can i expect uh, this assessments uh -huh. and task creations from the tosca or yes I'll, nice question definitely i'll answer for your question because here there is a tosca is a completely a technology okay so when you get into the tosca yes definitely assessment and task creations are definitely related to the tosca itself in a tosca how do we create a task yes yes everybody knows that how do we create how do we execute it but the same thing will not be conducted in a, each and every organization there will be a different process if it is a different process also the how do we approach for the same so in such categories in a such particular scenario how do we tackle it so in that way we will be train you in the span of duration of a particular work uh, particular our workshop in a workflow also is comes under the same how the workflows will be taken care under the tosca test automation and even though how do we if some people will be going to assign you sometime you should not be say that this task cannot be done by me but you should have a justification why you cannot do it why you can't do it and are you able to do it or not for everything you should have a justification okay such kind of justification orientation we will be going to give even a train for in this particular drive okay is that understand okay yes yes thanks okay. ma'am yeah, yeah. that makes sense okay and after that we will be explained entire the workflow from the development to each project release it means when you get into the project it suddenly come back and say you this will be the release this will be the sprint and this will be the development life cycle which we are following up at that time we will be get confused what would be this okay sometimes they will say the particular artifact the particular tosca seed you should execute in a dev environment okay sometimes they'll say in a seek environment you will be get confused what is a seek environment and what is a dev environment okay such kind of release and how they build it once the build is ready what should be taken care for the next step and where the regression steps comes under okay and when the regression should be start and when to be stop it where it will becomes for the request for announcement for every every sprint or if it is comes or not what the scrum call what will be going to do it in that so every relation every relate you with the relation with a real time process we will be going to taken care in this a particular development to the each project release here each and everything will be explained completely and thoroughly but the team but the member who is being attending this particular draw, drive they should be very proactive because these steps are very very important for to keep your job for a longer time okay 
and then the end of that we will be conducting a evaluation program okay so this evaluation program is not mandatory for everybody if anybody is very much interested how much i equipped from the particular this drive how much i have been learned from particular drive or a particular workshop if you wanted to know it then definitely you guys can go ahead under with particular workshop evaluation that we will be conduct at the end of the drive okay at least we will be understand where i am standing it am i able to handle the some scenarios am i equip some of the tosca expectations and have i learned all the aspects and whichever the aspects of the tosca and tosca and will it becomes under your picture or not okay so this evaluation makes you that where you are standing exactly okay so does it make sense for you yes nanda okay yes. yeah that makes sense for me and uh, after that this drive we will be conducting in a two ways because people are more interested in a way of uh, like you know some people are they more interested in online some people are they more interested on uh, offline classes that is the reason we have been come up with a two solution the drive will be conducting the mode of online because this will be conduct either in any of the meeting webex something like that we will be conduct in this and even though the people are more interested if they are away from this particular city or away from the uh, institute or some other some other of the location if they do they have in a constraint of location issues they can be attend this drive via in online mode itself we do not have any constraint for this and yes if you wanted uh, some people they want in a uh, mode of drive if they want in uh, offline mode yes definitely we are conducting in a workshop in a offline mode as well yes they can register they can call to the given number which we have been provided uh, which we have been provided in this particular slide so you can call to the any of the number and else you can drop an email to particular id else you can visit our site okay you can get registered let's make use of this particular program and let's make it cheer up in the it career okay that's this is what i wanted to convey to you guys okay so that's about it from the today program so let's connect it very soon and we will be conducting this particular program in the next 3 days it probably it probably comes in the next 3 days in the sense like in our 22nd or 22nd or 23rd the drive will be going to start already we have been filled up with a 15 members so only we are being cutting out for in the 30 people because more the crowd we are not able to handle it on the basis of that on the uh, the demand of the students that is the reason being that we have been conducting this so already we have been left with only 15 members if anybody is been interested just let uh, let's call on the number which have been provided here and let's meet up in the 23rd in the 23rd uh, december 23rd okay that's that's it that's it for my end and so bye bye see you bye now